That makes sense. One out of four out of this chapter. That shouldn't have been as funny to me as it actually was. Oh, he's pissed. Those troublesome scraps have done it again. First they stole my crown, now they stole my collar. Luckily the camera I give you has magical coloring properties. Take a photo of me and you'll see. Maybe you can choose a new backdrop. That's good enough for me, buddy. Oh, it's good to have my squirrel squirrelosity back, but the scraps will continue stealing collars wherever they go. If you see any other white objects in the travel, take a photo of them too. Well, that explains what that was. <laughs> I can't see. The camera doesn't like to play friendly. I will say that in this game. They sound like minions. You can hypnotize scraps with the guiding light, you can also throw things at them. Pick something up with square, and then press square again and throw it. You can pick up stunned scraps. Or I can just do this. Dead. Confused on exactly what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing right now. That? Not exactly what I'd call the best of pictures, but picture nonetheless. Like I said, sometimes this camera does not like to not like to play very nice. Out, didn't it? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> it's just like the way some of this stuff is, is just kind of weird. Not quite sure if it's just me or like, I don't know. 
Like I said, I just I don't know how I feel about this game so far. Okay. The camera is really annoying from <laughs> I will say that. The camera is really annoying to fight with in this game. Got it. Just like that. That's simple. This game's simple, I will say that. Like, there's not, a, you know, I don't feel like I've put a lot of thought into the things I do so far. It is a kid's game, but it's kind of like one of those weird games that's like, it's kind of in between actually being a kid's game. Just because of how, like, some of the stories played out, I guess. Oh, I ate me. Oops. Well, that's not what I wanted to happen. Oops. Is there infinite lies, by the way? If so, this game is way more forgiving than Little Big Planet. Eat him. I'll say, yeah, just eat the dude. It's like, I can't believe I got myself eaten, and then you're kind of like, wait a minute, yeah, I do. I completely believe that. I do like the art on- OH NO! <laughs> Alright, well I didn't know that was going to be a drawstring bridge, but... Hey, knock it off. Alright, well we'll wait. And now we'll go. I think those are checkpoints, by the way. I'm not entirely sure, though. Cool. Um... Also, cool. Made it. <laughs> oh, I miss that. The music I like a lot too. I have to say, the music's jamming it. I liked for the trailer too, the song they played on the trailer. It's like, uh, oh, Stealing Sheep by, uh, whatever the name of that band is. Hey there, if you have a PlayStation camera or a companion app connected to, then you show me what you look like. I don't. Um, I hope that's not a necessity for this game. <laughs> I don't imagine they would make it one. At least I feel like they wouldn't. You never know, though.
All right, I made it. The wasa wasailing party is about to begin. Good for it. <laughs> I don't know what to say to that. Sure. I guess I'm coming. No, the drumming isn't finished yet. The rot the great apple. I'm not entirely sure this is how we're supposed to kill these dudes, but this is how I'm going to do it. The great apple is planted here by the green man himself. Every year our drums entice it to grow so it can deliver us its seed. The wasiling cup awaits its offering. The Harvest Festival is complete. The Orchid Seed is saved. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> I crushed myself. I don't know how to get up there. I'm not going to worry about it. Music's jamming, though. He was greatest for ceiling party yet. Oh, and I'm dead. They're all like, ooh, he's dead. He just saved us and he is totally dead. The scraps almost ruined the party. It is true you're on the way to mend the hole in the sky. Take me to heaven. The world around you wants to help you on your journey. You just have to know how to ask. See that stone over there? Stories tell of its power to bring all things closer to the sky. Oh, crap. <laughs> hey, my dude can jump now. Back down to the ground with a bump. <laughs> Don't worry about that, Iota. This story is just getting started. You made a good impression here. You brought back light and color. You made the orchard sing. But you wouldn't have got this far without the help of that you out there. Iota, don't resist the forces that are guiding you. If the you wants you to jump, then jump. Good luck to you both. So we can jump now, which that's pretty nice. Like I said, can't deny the music's not pretty awesome in this game. A second player can customize and improve this world using a companion app. Find out more in the squirrel guide. Ooh.
Oh, I'm glad we can jump now. It's always like the most frustrating thing, not be able to jump in a game. You're the mender of the holes. The one who will guide the sky back together. Glue the sky back together. So no more evil can fall out of it. Then you must climb Gilbert Hill, the highest peak of the Valley Ford. Valley Fold. Yeah, I can do that, no problem. Where'd all the music go? Bonk. Well, we made it. <laughs> Yep. I'm kind of just waiting to see when we get to the next, uh, oh, there it is. Next chapter. Maypole Fields. Anyway, guys, I think this is where we're going to take a break and call it the end of session one for Tearaway. Hope you guys have enjoyed it so far. If you have, be sure to press that thumbs up button and subscribe. Like I said, any bit of help will definitely go a long way for this game, without a doubt. So, till next time, guys, take it easy. Peace.